10 months ago, in January of 2023, no one knew who Sam Selleck was. What is this? Now that's a cutie patootie. And little did he know that when he posted his first video on January 19th, that he was about to take YouTube by storm. Well, 10 months and 272 videos later, and Sam now has an incredible 2.3 million subscribers. <laughs> I'm not even jealous. But the question that everyone is asking is how did he possibly do this? Especially when the videos he posts look like this. But other than that, got to chill, eat some, uh, I, don't, I think some Costco wontons. If you've ever seen one of Sam's videos, then you know that there is close to zero editing. I mean, besides a few jump cuts and the badass intro, of course. Uh-huh, okay, what else? Watching one of Sam's videos literally feels like you've been thrown back in time to YouTube in 2010 when no one knew how to edit. But in a world where just about every video on YouTube today looks like this. We are now stranded on a raft in the middle of the ocean. And there goes our boat. We are now stranded for seven days. How are people possibly watching videos that look like this? Okay. Jesus. Well, the answer is authenticity. It seems like every big YouTuber today is making the exact same video. It feels like they all act the same, edit their videos the same, and it low-key feels like they all have the same exact personality. When I watch some of these YouTubers, they might have some pretty cool video ideas, but then I click on the video and this is what I hear. In this video, we will be building Bikini Bottom in real life. A couple months ago, I built SpongeBob's house in my backyard, and you guys flooded the comments saying I should do Squidward and Patrick's house next. So that's exactly what we're gonna do today. What's up, guys? Today, I will be making the world's biggest poop. Yeah, uh, it's a no from me, dog. I mean, all these big YouTubers just feel so robotic. I just, I can't put up with it anymore. They all sound the exact same. It feels like their videos are completely soulless. There's just no emotion, no personality, and it feels like they're reading off a script. And this tragedy is something known as Mr. Beastification, something that Sam has chosen not to take part in. Ah, ha, hell yeah, that's my guy. He just keeps his videos incredibly simple. From shots of him talking in his car, to eating food, to grocery shopping, to working out, his videos are just very raw. And in a time where everyone else's videos are just so over the top, this is exactly what people have been craving. People wanna watch someone that's relatable. People wanna see things that are real and authentic. And there is no denying that that is our boy Sam. I'm blushing, what about you? Just watching his videos, you can tell that the way he acts on camera is the way he acts in real life. He's just a dude being a dude. And that's what other dudes like to see. But there are a few other factors that led to his massive success. Number one, Sam's content is different. Sam found a way to stand out on YouTube with his super realistic, unedited thumbnails and plain video titles. Most videos on the YouTube homepage look like this. So when a video like this pops up, it catches people off guard and makes them want to click. Especially because he's effing massive. This man's bicep is bigger than my entire body. Number two, Sam's videos are very long. His videos range anywhere from 30 to 60 minutes long. And with all these people sitting and watching his videos, he is getting an insane amount of watch time that the YouTube algorithm just can't ignore. Like the YouTube algorithm has no choice but to push these videos out. And because these videos are so laid back, it just feels like you're listening to a friend talk. And a lot of people put his videos on in the background while they go and do other things. And that right there is how you get some freaking watch time, baby. Come on. Number three, Sam uploads every single day. Like this man is doing daily vlogs in 2023. What? Like that is unheard of these days. At this point, daily vlogs seem like a thing from the past. <laughs> I haven't watched anyone daily vlog since Nam. Like when Casey Neistat was daily vlogging back in 2015, that was a completely different era. And honestly, it kind of seems like no one has dared to attempt to daily vlog in years. But it looks like Sam is doing a pretty good job at bringing it back. Now, when you upload this consistently every single day, people start to add you into their daily routine. And that right there is a huge factor that plays into the millions of views that he gets. Now, what's also insane is how incredibly humble this guy is in his videos. Let me uh, let you guys in on a little secret. All right, you might want to sit down for this, but these uploads have made Sam rich as f Believe me when I tell you that this guy is making bank. This dude is pulling in 20 to 30 million views a month, which basically means he is making a minimum of $100,000 a month. But from watching his videos and seeing this... Check this guy out. All right, let's go. You would never know. 